Okay, so I have to go back and can't fly anymore. Tower 780, we're going around. Traffic on the runway. Tower 780, ready. Tower 780, kilo one will make 180 and taxi off runway to a left. Cessna Island Kilo, uh, contact ground. Cessna Island Kilo, unable. I need you to make a 180 taxi off of runway 28 left. And once you're off of runway 28 left, you need to contact ground. Cessna 57 Tango, go around, traffic on the runway. Go around, 57 Tango. Cessna Island Kilo, can you make a 180 right there, or uh, did you need to taxi down 28 left to, uh, to Charlie? I need to take three of your salaries. Uh, I think it's better for me. So it's 9 Kilo Roger. Can, uh, taxi via runway 2 left and turn left taxiway Charlie. Then contact ground. Thank you. Yes, I have 419 Lima Kilo, Montgomery Tower, Roger. Possible pilot deviation. I have a number for you to copy if you are ready. I'm ready. So I'm ready. Uh, that's 419 Lima Kilo. Uh, if you could you give me a call on my number, area code 858-277-2700. Eight five eight two seven five. Nope. Eight five eight two seven seven. Oh my God! Eight five eight two seven seven. Just a four one nine. Let me kill. Affirmative. Montgomery Tower, 400 minutes below. Research food stop and taxi back with two wheel. 4190. Alright, so that's the 4190 kilo. I'm sorry, what was your now re real request? Uh, I research to stop and have to back. Uh, right now I'm at Charlie. 4190 kilo. Alright, so that's the 4190 kilo. Do, do you understand, uh, what, what you did there? You passed the hold short bars for runway 28 left, so you were essentially on the runway, but you thought you were holding short of the runway, so that was where the problem lied. Okay, so I have to go back and can't fly anymore. No, no ma'am, I did, didn't say that. I just said there was a, we were giving you a possible pilot deviation and then I was explaining to you what the, the problem was. Uh, do you understand the hold short bars of the, the runways? Yes, I do. Okay, so that's 419 Lukilo. Let's uh, give it another try. Runway 28 left, taxi via Hotel Bravo. Six left, stop Hotel Bravo. 419 Lukilo, stop. Thank you. That's the 215 of Foxtrot. Thanks for the patience. 28 right, taxi via Juliet Hotel and Alpha. Greensboro Tower, uh, Archer 559 or 32. Say again. Tower uh, 559 or 32. 55932, Greens Tower, runway uh, 5 left, clear to land. 5 left, clear to land, 55932. Tower 55932, uh, there's a look like a Cessna that was awfully close that just passed by us on short miles of 5 left. And 932, that Cessna is like 2 miles in front of you for the right side. I don't think there was uh, the same, uh, same Cessna. Um, it was a high wing, it could have been other type of aircraft, but 532. And we're 932, yep, I just seen it, it primary just popped up beneath you, you said he was right behind you, huh? He was right over me, probably uh, 300 feet or so, 532. Attention on aircraft, this is Greensboro Approach on guard. There's an aircraft that is four nautical miles northwest of Greensboro Airport, northbound. Altitude last observed at 1,800 feet. You just overflew a Cherokee on final. You're in violation of Class Charlie airspace. Change to my frequency, 119.1. 119.1. Acknowledged by IDENT. Tower, good afternoon. Break at 49.24, visual 5 right. Break at 49.24, Greens Tower, runway 5 right, clear to land. 5 right, clear to land, break at 49.24. 
Greensboro Tower, November 7643, golf confirmed, right traffic, 05 right. And number 43 Golf, uh, turn a left downwind for a runway 5 left. We'll put you back on a 5 left side now. Left traffic, 05 left, 43 Golf, thank you. Tower 55932, five, turning off the active, that's 03. Tower 55932, five, Greensboro Ground Taxi to the MRO via Hotel Delta. And um, that, uh, uh, that uh, small prop that... Uh, you uh, reported to the tower controller. You said he was 200 feet above you. Yeah, it uh, it was a little surprising because uh, yeah, I it for me seemed he was between I'll say 200 and 400 feet above me, and he, he passed uh, right by me uh, to the left, plus 932 and uh, Hotel Delta to the right. 932, Roger. Uh, do you remember what altitude you were at when he had passed you? You say around like 1700. Roughly 1,700, correct, about the 932. All right, awesome. Thanks for your help, because uh, that's obviously a Class C violator. We weren't talking to him, and uh, we I even saw him out the window, too. Uh, I do have a number for you to call. Our downstairs supervisor would like to talk to you about it so he can uh, help resolve this. Roger. Um, one one second. Uh, I need to pull something up to, to copy the number about the 932. Okay, and I just want to clarify, nothing's wrong with you. He just wants to get the information from you so he can report it.